What's up YouTube? I am PK. Let's see key highlights about Union Budget 2020. Finance Minister Nirmala Sitharaman presented the Union Budget for 2020-2021 in Lok Sabha. Number 1. Tax. A new tax regime has been introduced where you cannot take any deductions on the rent. Where? But you still have options to go under the old slab rates and use the deductions or use the new slab rate without any deductions. Let's see the comparison between the old and the new slab rate on the screen. In the new slab rate, over 70 deductions have been removed. Let's see on the screen a calculation of old and the new slab rate. Let's say you have an annual income of 14 lakhs in the new and the old. In the old one, you have an, a directions of ADC under 1,50,000 and ADD of 40,000. A total of 1,90,000 will be directed and your taxable income will come around 12,10,000. But in the new, your taxable income will be same of 14 lakhs only. Let's see from row 8 in the screen. You are a two lakh. Your tax lab differential calculations to two lakh fifty thousand. You don't have any tax from two lakh fifty thousand to five lakhs. You charge five percent commonly for both new and the old. So your tax tax will come around twelve thousand five hundred for new and old. From five lakhs to ten lakhs in the old, you get a twenty percent. They charge twenty percent. Let's say. 5 lakhs to 10 lakhs is 5 lakhs. Five, in 5 lakhs, you take 20%, it will come around 1 lakh. In the new, they have divided 5 lakhs to 7 lakhs 50,000, row number 12. So, 5 lakhs to 10, uh, 7 lakhs 50,000 is 2 lakhs 50,000. In 2 lakhs 50,000, if you charge 10, 25,000 from row, in row 13, 7 lakh 50,000 to 10 lakhs. The 2 lakh 50,000, if you charge 15%, it will come around 37,500. In row number 14, 10 lakhs to 12 lakhs 50,000 in the old. So, 2 lakh 50,000, if you charge 30%, it will come around 63,000. In the row number 15, 10 lakhs to 12 lakhs 50,000 in the new. So, 2 lakh 50,000, if you calculate 20%, it will come around 50,000. Again in row number 16, 12 lakhs 50,000 to 14 lakhs. Remember your total income, your total taxable income is 14 lakhs. So we are calculating the new under 14 lakhs. So 12 lakhs 50,000 to 14 lakhs will give around 1 lakh 50,000 for which you will calculate 25% which will give you be give, giving around 37,500. Your row number 17, your total tax for for the annual income of 14 lakhs if you calculate from the old and the new the old will give a total tax of 175500 whereas in the new a total tax of 162500 let's go to row number 18 ss of 4% is applied for the old and the new in the old it is coming around 7020 in the new it is coming around 6500 if you go to row number 19 the total tax for the old and the new is given given so in the old, if you see, it is coming around one lakh eighty-two thousand five twenty, and in the new, it is coming around one lakh sixty-nine thousand. If you see a beneficial one, a comparison between the old and the new, the new tax rate is actually feasible and it is actually profitable. Most of the people were talking that the old tax rate was really feasible and it had directions of one lakh ninety thousand, whereas in the new slab rate. You your tax percentage, let's say if it was 10% earlier, now it is like 5%. If it was 20% earlier, now it is like 15%. Like that it is calculated. And that is why your rate of tax has been come down. My frank opinion is that it is better to go for a new slab rate because when you compare both and see, you are getting a minimum of 10,000 as a profit in the new slab rate. Companies will no longer be required to pay dividend distribution tax. Number 2. Economic and Finance Bank deposit insurance cover has been increased from 1 lakh to 5 lakh per depositor. Government is actually planning to amend the Companies Act which was formed earlier. The government decided to sell part of its stakes in LIC via public offering. Number 3. Agriculture a whopping 2.83 lakh crores budget has been allocated to this sector comprising the allied activities as well to help 20 lakh farmers to build a standalone solarized pump and to help 15 lakh farmers to build a solar power grid agri credit limit to set 15 lakh crore 
for 20 to 2021. Number four, health and sanitation. Whopping 69,000 crores are being allocated to the health sector. 12,300 crores has been allocated for Swetch Bharat this year alone. Proposal to set up hospitals in tier two and tier three cities in connection with the private sector. Number five, education. Allocated 99,200 crores for education in 2021 and 3,000 crores allocated for skill development. Degree level full fledged online courses to be launched by NRF to support the underprivileged sector. Number six, infrastructure. Proposal to provide 1.7 lakh crores for this sector. Proposal of new Chennai Bangalore Express Highway to be started and uh, Bengaluru Urban Rail project to be also started. Railway to achieve 27,000 kilometers electrification lines alone. If you want to see more such videos, kindly do subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our notifications.